Corn silking in the latest week was reported at 4% overall, with half of the primary corn production states reporting progress in this category so far. Silking refers to the emergence of silk-like strands from the end of ears. This stage occurs approximately two to four days after the tassel is emerged. Conditions of the 2017 corn crop were unchanged from the previous week, with a combined 80% rated in fair to good condition and 12% in excellent shape. Spring wheat conditions were barely improved in the latest report, with a combined 28% in poor to very poor condition. Pasture and range conditions were also slightly downgraded in the latest week. On the plains, isolated showers and thunderstorms are providing only spotty relief from widespread dry conditions. The region's most serious drought covers the northern plains. For continued updates on the 2017 growing season, subscribers should click on the news link in Comtel. In other news, Erner Berry Newswires has released the pre-report survey of estimates ahead of this week's quarterly hogs and pigs report. Here's Thomas Lloyd with the details. Analysts predict the quarterly hogs and pigs report scheduled for release Thursday afternoon to show moderate increases in all categories. The all hogs number is predicted to be up about 3.3% from a year ago, while the kept for breeding figure is at 1.4% over last year. Hogs kept for marketing were pegged at 3.4% above a year ago. Summer and fall farrowings were seen up slightly from 2016. The projected percentage increase in supplies is less than that of the additional processing capacity to come online this year. For more on Erner Barry Newswire survey, subscribers can click on the news link under the red meat tab in Comtel. Thanks, Tom. Next up, poultry market reporter Terrence Wells has the latest analysis from the turkey market. Not since 2012 has the whole body turkey market been as precariously positioned as it is right now. With year-to-date slaughter running in the fourth highest position ever and whole bird inventories currently ranked third behind 2009 and 2013, it's not too surprising that the market is in the shape it's in. As the chart indicates, 2012 displayed a flat line early in the year, running 14 consecutive weeks without change. Currently, the whole body turkey market is in its 18th week, and there are few signs of that being altered soon. Processors are hopeful that 2017's underperforming market might help offset the potential for declining pre-Thanksgiving values later this year. Thanks, Terrence. That concludes our show for today. Thanks for watching, and be sure to head over to the news tab in Comtel for a comprehensive look at the latest market and industry news. Today's video is sponsored by Epsano's Market Insight for the Meat Industry, providing information, education, and insight for the beef, pork, and poultry industries. View a sample report at Epsano.com or call 800-932-0617 to get your free sample today.